There's a few favorite moments that I've had over the years. Um, I think one of the, my favorite is just walking in the stand every day and seeing it crowded and packed and everybody, you know, excited and cheering us on. I think the m most memorable thing I will have is just like every day, like going to the locker room, hanging out, going to practice, having a good time. I think they're very bittersweet. You know, it's always uh, exciting to you know, have it come to an end, it's what you worked for, it's, you know, everything that you've been uh, trying to accomplish, you know, that's finally starting to be present. But it's also sad, you know, you're going to miss things, aspects, people, so it's just very bittersweet. Um, I don't know, like, where has the time gone? I mean, I've been in college for five years, but it goes by so quick and I'm, like, getting kind of sad. But, I don't know, it's just like it flies by super quick. It's been, like, such a great group of girls this year and we all get along so well and I think the fans and just like the atmosphere in the stand when we're playing. I don't know. I think like we'll just be like standing around and he's like, and there'll be like someone standing right there and he's like, where's Casey? And she's like standing right by him and he'll like, for like 10 minutes he's like, where's Casey? And she's like right beside him. He does that every day in practice. <laughs> oh. We had morning weights at 6.30 during the summer and Dave walked up to morning weights wearing two different shoes. And uh, we were like, Dave, like, what happened? Did you, like, not look in the morning? And he goes, oh, well, Mary's not here, so my, my clothes weren't laid out for me. And uh, so he had on a shoe and a slipper. I was like, did you not feel the difference? Like, did you not feel the draft? Or, like, what, what, what was going on here? So uh, I definitely think that that was one. There are many more, but I definitely think that was one that I'll always kind of remember. He kept calling me Anna, and... Um, he told me like multiple times, I have a niece named Anna, that's why I'm like, just call me Ponce, it's easier. So, over time though, he got it right, so. Yeah, one time he like had this brand new golf club, and he was like, like showing it off to everyone, and I was like, whoa, let me see, and I just took a swung and it like scraped the bottom of the, of the ground, and he was like, oh my gosh, that's brand new, and I was like, oh no. I was like, I was like, oh, I'm so sorry, like, I didn't know it was going to happen. Like, I've never swung a golf club, but that was, like, a really bad idea. But it was a funny story, so.